from Jaipur, my name is Ivana and today we are off to Amberfort but first I need to eat something because I'm freaking hungry I got some street food and this is filled with potato masala Cheers mm. This is really good Fresh mm. So you may have noticed that Oh, I'm talking to you <laughs> Uh, I'm wearing more traditional clothes today, even though they're very, very wrinkled from my suitcase. But my driver already said I look Indian, another guy said I look Indian. Perfect. <laughs> what did you say? She looks Indian with the dress. Yeah. Not, not the, it's good, the, it's good uh, disguise. <laughs> but he actually, do you know a little bit Dutch? Yes, I do. You do? What do you know? In Moy. What? In Moy. Hail <laughs> Moy! It means uh, very beautiful. Yes, you are. Yeah. Oh. She's eating food and makeup. <laughs> yes, I ate the street food. He helped me with it. What else did you say? Oh, that is so Dutch. Translated in English, it means uh, look, look, not buy. <laughs> it's very, very Dutch. It's gonna take us a while because the traffic is crazy. Probably an hour or something. Hey, uh, I was actually waiting for the manager and then I saw you brought those girls so I was like, okay, you, you probably are a nice guy. And you look like a nice guy, so. <laughs> This place is literally one of the most beautiful, if not the most beautiful palace life port I've ever seen. Wow. Let's go. Chala. This is too pretty. Oh my gosh. Apparently there are three ways to go up, by jeep, by elephant or by foot like I'm doing right now. I could use the exercise and I do not like to ride elephants. So option number three it is. Chalo chalo. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna go through the gates. This place is ridiculous. It is so beautiful. I think honestly the beauty will not come across on the wheel. Trust me, it's gorgeous. I can't even look at this. It's so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Let's go in. The biting ticket. Wow. This, this place is ridiculous. I can't even. No. This is too pretty. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Wow. The view is gorgeous too. Wow. Here we go, guys. This is the hall of public audience. It's ridiculous. <laughs> this whole palace sports. It's too pretty. Check out the gardens. So this is what we saw when we came up. Well, this gate. Wow. Just wow. I, I have no other words. I'm flabbergasted. This is so beautiful. Can I live here please? I promise everybody can come and party and visit. This place is too beautiful. Okay. Let's go through it. Oh, these doors. Oh my gosh. Everything is so beautiful. Wow. Courtyard. I 
I'm for sure not going to be able to show you everything, nor do I want to. You need to just visit this place for yourself because it's way too freaking gorgeous to only watch a video. Come here yourself. But I will try to show you as much as possible because it's ridiculous. It's so pretty. Look at this building. Wow. Look at the ceilings. Wow. The ceiling. God, this is too pretty. We are now in a small corridor. To I think the rooftop. Sure. I think it is. So much lights. Yes, it is. Oh, we can go higher. Okay, let's check this out first. Well, oh my gosh. <gasps> wow. Check out through this window. Oh, beautiful view. I just heard this is still private property of a royal family. Who do I need to be friends with to live here? <laughs> I'm so in love with this place. It's just too beautiful, man. And there are all these small hallways and steps and all those details. Like, even look at the windows. So pretty. More steps and secret passageways. And now on the other side of the rooftop. This side is maybe being renovated or something. We've already been there. So this way. Because there, there are other steps and secret passageways. Oh snap. It's so peaceful here. I don't think most people get to this place. Wow. This is nice. More secret doors. More secret doors. Where are we going? Wow. This place is huge. Oh snap. I haven't even been to this far. I think this is being renovated. Because it doesn't look as pretty as the other side. Just having a look at these small corridors. This side is so much more peaceful. There's a lot of people here. I just met the nicest group of guys ever. So five Indian guys. They, uh, one of them lives in New Zealand. I think the other ones too because they're all friends and they're here for a month. And <laughs> they took pictures of me but they were not perfect so I asked them to do it again and then they waited a half an hour trying to clear this gate they were literally <laughs> trying to get people away from me to get the perfect picture they were so nice guys if you ever get to see this thank you <laughs> in case you didn't notice this fort is a freaking musty you have to come here right now I'm just walking back to the rickshaw and I'm freaking hungry so let's get back to the city <laughs> This guy, he is so much fun. Like he just asked me like, okay, I have one question for you. And if you answer it correctly, I will buy you chai or beer. I don't drink, so chai. And he was like, where, where's the first Albert Heijn store in the Netherlands? I was like, how do you know this? I was like, I don't know. Um, Zandam, actually I do know because my ex is from Zandam and he always used to tell that story very proudly. So, how do you know? This, is, this guy is awesome. <laughs> what the F? He can even sing songs from Dutch artists. Sing it, sing it. Total touch. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my gosh, he is amazing. My wonderful rickshaw driver dropped me off here because apparently they have Dal Bati, the best one. So some of you guys already recommended this in the comments, but it's really hard for me to keep up with suggestions in the comments. That means I would have to write it down then. I, I'm not that that good with writing things down. So if you want to suggest me something, suggest me something on Snapchat. And Chetan did exactly that. And then I can take a screenshot and then I can look for the food. So thank you so much, Chetan. I am going to have dalbati. Look what I got, look what I got. I got a tali with dalbati. Yes. Nom 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 nom. The struggle of a foreigner where you don't exactly know how to eat everything. So start with easy. Just some pizza. Chapati, rice. Chapati, chapati. Chapati. Rice. Yeah. Unlimited time. Freaking awesome. Mm. This stuff is so good. It's like perfect. The spices are in perfect balance. You just live. Mm. Mm -hmm. My rickshaw driver rules. And I'm talking with my mouthful, sorry. And I love it when Indian people help me. So apparently, I'm supposed to mix this with the dal. I hope I'm doing this right. What is this? Yes, thank you. What is this? This one. Sweet? sweet? sweet. Ah, okay, okay. Sweet. So nah. sweet. Okay. So in this one, I mix here. Yes, mix. mix okay. Okay. Thank you. Indians, you are so freaking sweet. This is basically the best place ever. I have no words. Unlimited tali. Trying the dal bati. No, I still, I'm not a professional. That was really good. And now I'm eating a sweet. And it's such an interesting sweet. I love the spices and it's super crumbly. And there are some nuts in it. <laughs> and then the camera died. This is easily one of the best meals I have had in India. And there wasn't even paneer involved. Can you imagine? It was that good. Mm. I always wear leggings because it's way more comfortable. So found the perfect colors. If you would like to travel along, click that subscribe button. And if you like this video, put a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!